Welcome back to uh, GDPG. You know, for a second, way to start on a load screen, by the way. For a second, <laughs> I actually had the like, the um, uh, ah! the uh, uh, what was it? Uh, 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 the like. Oh damn it! I missed those credits. The like inclination, like the 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 wanting the. I don't know, man. Like, I, I, I was gonna say, like, welcome to Affinity Archives. <laughs> this is GDPG. The instinct to say, maybe that's the word I'm looking for. The instinct. I, like, I instinctually wanted to say welcome to Affinity Archives, but I was like, wait a second. <laughs> we stopped calling this channel Affinity Archives since. Dude, we didn't even more call than it year. Affinity Archives like, since I've been on. Oh no, this yeah, this was way before your time. This was back when we re used to record in like our apartments, and we still do technically, but we have a dedicated studio, studio space now. A studio? Yeah. The Vinci games? But it was just, like, out in the living room, and, like, with yeah. desk lamps being our lighting. Dude, we all start somewhere. It's, you know, it, it honestly feels really good to see how far we've come as a oh, channel. Oh, absolutely. Uh, for those of you who are watching, this is episode two of Bunker Punks. Yeah, I mean, if you couldn't tell by the title. Also known as Punky Bunkers in Punky. the Star Funks. Dude, oh my god. That's a game. Write that down. <laughs> Write that down. Fluffy Bunker Punker Bunks. I'd play that. <laughs> that's that's an indie game if I ever did yeah, hear right. one. <laughs> Actually, I'll be about, like, shooting stuffed animals through a cannon. Uh, you took it too far. Oh, you know what? Fine. I'm glad I did. No regrets. No ragrets. No ragrets. YOLO. No, you took it too far again. YOLO. Oh, man. So, we haven't talked at all about how this game is procedurally generated. Mm, yes. Uh, but it is. I actually talk about the game, huh? All right. There we go. Done. I mean, Episode do you, over. Do you guys really want to hear about how the game works? Like, is that why you're here? Or are you here to see two sexy dudes... Take off all their clothes for money. Then we don't get money. Because if, if that's the case, you're at the wrong channel. <laughs> um, uh, this is game devs play that's, games. That's, that's another door down. Yeah, um, yeah. That's uh, that's Stripper Joe and the Mahula Hand oh, Clan. Dude, Stripper Joe is my favorite. Stripper. Yeah, man. I'm gonna be I'm gonna be at Dallas, Dallas Beach, Beach again. Because you go to the shotguns, man. Yeah, do shotguns. I'm way more about the shotguns in this game. Shot it's it's because so shotguns are really effective in this because they not only have like a wider radius, right? Where sure. the assault rifle, while it you know the rapid fire is like all over the place, it's um, more it's, focused. It consumes a lot of ammo yes. for each shot. <laughs> um, shotgun, you deal a lot of damage in a wide area. Area. Um, all you have to do is be closer to them, yeah. but you don't have to be adjacent to them like you do with the baseball bat. So I feel like right, right now, and, and you know, I'm sure hopefully people feel otherwise, right? Because otherwise then that means the game is in balance. Mm. Um, but right now it feels like the shotgun is the best weapon of the game. I feel like a lot of games, those shotguns are generally revered as like one of the best weapons in the game because you can just go up close and just blow some stuff up it's, with it. It's true, man. I mean, it's the same reason that like the knife is is one of the best things in games like Call of Duty. <laughs> right, Because exactly. it insta-kills, right? Yeah. It's like everything has health except when you have insta-kill. <laughs> yeah, right. So when you have insta-kill, you win. So if they're not going to insta-kill you, then you're going to insta-kill them. doesn't matter how long it takes for you to get to them, because it's generally not very long. Hashtag insta-kill. Nah, I'm not going to put a hashtag No, you're not going to put that up. <laughs> no, this isn't the Bastard Saga. No, it is far oh, from... Oh, man, it's well Ooh, over by this, this point, nice. huh? Yeah, I mean, we could always come back to the Bastard Saga if people really it want. It was but getting votes. It was getting votes. I think it was mostly like one or two people. So yeah. sorry to you guys if, if we don't come back to it for a while. Um, it's but not we that will we will do Banner Saga too. Oh, absolutely. We we'll... already have some. some yeah. Yeah. Uh, we're put on the list the to get list. some keys. So. Oh, list. Who knows when we'll actually get copies of the game? But we do have actual press access to it. So. Yep. Although you won't get to hear my lovely commentary on the game. No, that one's going to be just intangible and I, but we're stoked. We're also not going to be as like, we're not going to be bastards. Well, no. We're, we're no, going to be I, like... I, I too am stoked for the game. In case you guys were wondering, <laughs> I'm not like that when I play Banner Saga. No. I, uh, that was I, the whole point of, of your playthrough. Oh, absolutely. 
<laughs> oh, ab abs absolutely. 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 So, like, I feel like there's a lot of robots in the medical bay. Oh, well, this is totally the, like, dystopian utopia where the world is, like, run by robots because we've made them to do so. Oh, video game idea. Dystopian utopian. That... What? We got it, man. Million dollar idea. You're welcome, world. Dude, that's how original ideas are done. Yep. You just, like, make up new words and boom, new idea. Yep. Boom. Million dollars in the bank right away. Dude. Millionaire. Give it a year. Milliner. <laughs> Milliner got it there. Milliner. 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 It's um, like the drunk version of uh, Thor's hammer. So I'm trying to figure out when this game Milliner. is going to drop. So if this if this is May and you guys are watching this game, uh, if it's May, I hope you enjoyed Civil War. I'm sure I did. <laughs> um... Baseball season is probably started by this point. Go, go Cubbies. Um, and uh, video games are like still a thing. So, yeah. So, remember that I said it first. Where are you going with this, in man? In March. What? What is happening? <laughs> just I'm just throwing everything out there. So, when they watch this, they'll be like, oh, these guys recorded it last night for today. What? No, we're good, man. Okay, I'm just I'll I'll just roll with it. Bases covered. We all know what happened. It's it's May. Is it May? I don't know. Is it May? It's gonna be May. It's gonna be May. All I'm saying is I'm I'm Jones and for Game of Thrones. Dude, April 24th. And again, if this is already <laughs> released in May, wasn't that first episode so crazy? <laughs> right. <laughs> Absolutely. I, I mean, this episode's probably gonna release, like, before <laughs> April even hits us. Dude, I know, but it's gonna be so great when people watch it. Maybe before April hits us, you realize when we're recording this, April's like a week away. I know, I'm gonna try to release this in the next couple of days. Oh, really? Well, God, why did you tell me that before? I did. We have so much other content, I just assume we're good until, like, we, May. We talked about it, well, we are. I, I oh, yeah! We're probably gonna have an update video before this. Even, well, maybe not. I don't know because I've been really bad at update videos. So we're gonna have an update video at some point, right? Just, because we need. If it is we, May, it may be out already. We need an update video. But any of you guys that have been wondering, like, hey, why did they stop releasing two episodes a day? Like, where is it? At? Oh my god, you still have me an update video uh, for that? It's. Ooh. I've. I've had. A, I've. I had food poisoning. I've been busy with the day job. It's just. And if it's May again. That's all happened at this point. <laughs> I know, it's bad. But Damn. so if you guys are wondering, like, hey, why did you guys stop releasing two episodes a day? Um, we've been I've been meaning to tell okay. to have an update video to tell you guys, but basically it it's a time constraint thing. Um, yeah, we're kinda of in a video game right now. Um Fish Lap. Again, if it's May, we might be close to releasing the game. Hopefully. We're not sure. We were planned to release it in April and that's the um, if that's the case, uh, <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, just we have a game. It's called Fish Slap. <laughs> no, it's well, yeah, we're we're working on it. You could actually follow it if you if you woo, if you would like. Yeah, it'll be right here over the screen. Uh, uh I don't have a plan. Actually, I would say look at the description. Look at the yeah, yeah. Look we, at the description. We, we can't actually put annotations. Um, oh, in the video. In the video that would direct people well, to fine websites. Well, like you'll that. see some stuff somewhere about our game. Um, it's gonna be a lot of fun. Right, it's gonna be a mobile right, game. Right, write a note for me anyway, just so I don't forget, though. Yeah, no problem. Um, I can't really see the time since the time is not up, but yes. That's okay. But either way, like, Fish, Fish Lap is, is our, like, PC mobile game. It's hopefully going to be our first commercial release. Um, so any of you guys that have been wondering, like, hey, these guys are called Game Devs Play Game. Like, where are all their games? I promise you... They're coming. They're coming. And we've, if it's already May... We've gone through... Two it's other long-term failed projects already, um, and those are not worth showing the world. Yeah, and so our next YouTube series will be called Game Devs Fail Games, <laughs> um, and that'll be an in-look document, an in-depth documentary on how we uh, we started everything. Yeah. Oh no. Probably keeping that title when we make our failed documentary. You know, failing isn't actually a bad Dude, thing. Dude, no, in failing my is a great thing. I think failing is the best way to learn. That's that's why I like. Floor is clear. That it's it's hard, right? Because YouTube 
YouTube like really cares about authenticity, and I really, really hope we don't seem inauthentic just because we don't have any like commercial games. We have a lot of like playable game jam games, but we're just not selling anything because we don't have anything worth selling. Um, no, we're getting there. We're getting there. And it's like if we're gonna sell something, it's gonna be good. That's oh, why. Absolutely. That's why the projects that failed. We scrapped completely because they weren't worth it. They weren't worth like continuing work on. They it's weren't worth like selling. It's kind of like you're trying to run before you've learned to crawl. I exactly. And anyone that's been in game development will know that like your first ten games are going to be absolutely horrendous. Um, and while I've worked on at least ten games at this point, um, the rest of the team hasn't. Right. And so we're still working out a lot of our kinks. And we're learning. We're learning. But, uh, yeah, you guys will see more from Affinity Archives coming up here. Um, especially if it's almost Mac. <laughs> yes. Man, I need more health. You do, dude. Um, oh, let's talk about the game, though, huh? Yeah, um, I was going to say, we, we kind of deviated right. a bit. It's, not, I mean, it's still all within the realm of, you know, video games. Um, I mean, this is score. an indie development game. This is an indie dev that made this game. Yeah, right. We're I, indie devs, too. It's... It, it all makes sense. You know, it's all about supporting each other, right? It's all about, you know... Well, that's, like, the whole reason what, that we really... At least, that's the whole reason I started the show, right? Yeah, right? We... <laughs> way back in the day... Um, back we, in we, my day, we, I remember playing multiple games. Well, the Affinity Archives website actually used to be kind of like a review oh, and yes. kind of, like, oh. bloggy website. Uh, it was a WordPress, actually. Oh, WordPress. Oh, WordPress. I used to be a movie reviewer on a WordPress site. Oh, I'm so happy that I we moved off, off of WordPress. Like and for those of you who have WordPress, there's nothing wrong with that. You know, everyone starts it's, somewhere. It's the limitations but that, yes, that drove me there crazy. There are a lot of limitations on WordPress. And it's hard for, at times, it's hard for people to want to take you seriously when you have WordPress, which is really lame, because you can have some great content out there. That's, that's true. I mean, that's what... Um, custom uh, domains are good for you, which yes. you can do on WordPress, but like, and that, we're not sponsored by WordPress too, I should specify. Yeah, that. yeah, we're, we're not, we're not um, saying the name law, they're not paying us for every time we say it. No. Um, um, but, it's, I, when I started learning CSS and HTML coding, I, I wanted to like, you know, make the website yeah, cool. pretty. And since we weren't self-hosting our own site, or our, even our own WordPress site, right? Like, we just didn't have that control. So that's why I'm happy that even though our website right now is still garbage, uh, it's a work at in least, progress. at least I have full creative control, and that's that's <laughs> and what that's I like. <laughs> well, even you know, when you're making a game and you're running a show and running a company and working a day job and working a day job, you kind of like yeah. start not and doing making it rain. I'm making it rain. Well, you start not, like, spending as much time on things like websites. Yeah. It, it sucks, but it's, like, the natural uh, sacrifice. Right, but any of you guys that work on things would probably understand. Probably understand that. Where is that elevator? Uh, I think we've got one or two rooms left. We were talking about this on the stream, but uh, I was saying how a mini map might be nice in this yeah, game. Yeah, it might be interesting. Um, we just had a pretty good conversation on the stream about whether or not the mini map would be good. Yeah, we actually it, it was kind of fun because a lot of people ha actually were commenting and kind of having mixed feelings about it. But um, I think we pretty much settled on the idea that a mini map would be nice, but it should be toggleable. Like if you don't want to see it, you should be able to yeah, turn it off. Should be able to be like, nope. Um, and then you and I were saying, like, if there is ooh, the fog that of is, war. yeah, we, it should be a fog of war style where you only see the rooms that you've been in, and you can only see like doorways to where you can go. Oh, dude. Uh, uh, well, well, this is as good a time as any to. Uh, we're we're not totally done. We we still have one more character because we unlocked multiple characters for each run. Yes. So. Well, it's a good time oh, it's a to final stop gift. this episode. All punks receive the following 25 damage to shotguns. That's oh, actually really cool. That is super sweet. So, uh, question of the day. I don't know. Uh, yeah, minimap. What do you guys feel about a minimap? Do you think that this game would benefit from a minimap, or do you think it's just better without one? It's yeah. pretty small, so it doesn't really hurt to not have one, but... Yeah, so please interact with us below in the comments, and also, guys, remember to vote to see if you want to... If you want to watch us still play more uh, Bunker Punks 
for and, another game. And if you ever want to see this sucker singing, check out our Facebook page. Oh, we'll yeah, a lot please. of in behind you'll, the scenes you'll, you'll or behind the scenes videos. All sorts of dumb things I do. <laughs> and all sorts of dumb things we all do. We have a blast making these videos. We love putting them mm -hmm. out. So, yeah, take a look at our Facebook page. It's pretty awesome. <laughs> Thanks for watching, everyone. Stay tuned for the next episode, and uh, we'll see you later. Bye. See you in the archives. Oh. <laughs> it's a hey, I can't... Uh...